Hello everyone, we hope you all are doing well. Welcome to another fantasy match preview. This is for the game between New Zealand and Sri Lanka. And while the last few days have been dark clouds and a lot of problems in terms of rain, we hope that this game is going to be clear and we have Nikhil Bhai with us to carry you through the preview. Bilkul, yes, thank you as always for having me. Uh, after a good set of games, slight break for all of us. Good to get hmm. some energy back and some sleep as well. So, yes, back with uh, two very dangerous teams. And I think, obviously, as you World Cup, we kept saying, yeah, yeah, it's not for the straightforwards. So, pressure will be a lot of teams. But I think a lot of calcies will be out. So, hmm. please invest very accordingly. Right, absolutely. And while we don't have a calcie giveaway, we also don't <laughs> have a jersey giveaway of today's games because both of the games got washed out. But we'll have a jersey giveaway for this game at the end of the video. So before we do that, let's look at venue conditions to know whether there'll be a game or not. So the game's going to be played at the Sydney Cricket Ground. And the good news that we have is weather is expected to be clear. But this is Australia, so you can never say. But yes, very unlikely that it should rain. And like we know, square boundaries are short here, while straight boundaries slightly longer. Bilkul and up till now, the pitch has been very fine. As such, you have no hindrance. Laga nahi hai. Or uh, if you bowl well, you get wickets. If you bat well, there is plenty of runs also for you to make make that up. So I think the average will remain the same. Up to I think 160 is probably par. You get hmm. 20 more great score to have. So and of course, spin is coming into the game as well. And traditionally, hmm. SCG has a little bit of spin. Both that. Well, the pace is going to be Hmm. Haan, pacers will still take more wickets, but spin completely bar nahi hoga. So I think the same thing remains here. And hmm. uh, team, both the teams have plenty of options with the ball. Sri Lanka a bit more hit by injuries. So how is it playing? How is it playing? Let's take a look at our investment. Aur, uh, uh, ye right, Bilkul. And before we make and figure out what our base team for this game is, we hope all of you are investing well in the investment leaderboard. I shared the rankings after both the washout games so that you guys have some context. So you can check yeah. on the Fantasy Crypto Telegram channel and scale up your investments accordingly or stay on the same run rate or if you're already in the top three. And the gaps are not yeah. much. The gaps are only about 700, 800. So just yeah. join a few extra contests and you'll plug the gap. Bilkul or... Nothing like you know using it for the best purposes in terms of multiple combinations. Leaderboard, one leaderboard, say, you don't look at it, the leaderboard is bad. You have to win. So, base team strong, okay, as always. Multiple rotations, banai, and uh, have a good time. Right. The irony is that whatever hard work you do in that one leaderboard will also reward you in the other leaderboard. Exactly. Because when you make multiple combinations and you join yeah. more contests, you also scale up here. So it's like. You are working towards one, but you are getting benefits in both. So why not make best use of the chance? Uh, bilkul, aur ye ke mat khelo ke ye Ek team hmm. bana, everything will fall in place. So back yes. your visualization based on whatever inputs information you get from everywhere. And uh, yes, to Yes, bilkul. So let's look at what best base team we can make for this game. So New Zealand and Sri Lanka at the top of the fan to play app currently. And this is the amazing leaderboard contest that we were talking about. So please remember to join it. But yes, let's look at our team for this specific game. First up in the keeping section, we have gone with the safest possible choice in Devin Cordway because he plays low risk cricket and will not play too many rash shots. Why we have not taken Kusal Mendes is something we'll discuss when we get to the bowling section. And the three batters, Kane Williamson, Glenn Phillips and Nisanka. Bilkul to dekhi, jaise kusal yahan pe kusal risk hai, sabhi ke liye. But the thing here we are expecting is because Sri Lanka are injury hit, we are expecting more than all rounders to come to the game. Or hmm. like we know, our bias, we prefer all rounders more than batters any given day of any year, even hmm. if it's a leave year. So that continues here. And uh, in the batting section, you always have an option of safe bank of Patumi Sanka. Now, he may not give you the runs at the side of 200, but he's getting you runs. So I think that is primarily of more importance. 
तो इसके लिए उनको लिया है ग्लेन फिलिप्स अभी तक उनका वो बड़ा एक इम्पैक्ट नॉक नहीं है विच वी थिंक इज वेरी गुड एंड इट कुड पोटेंशियली रोल इज आम ओवर एज वेल अब तक हुआ नहीं बट आई एल नॉट बी सरप्राइज इफ इट कम्स अलॉन्ग सू केन यस अब यहाँ पे अगर आप कहो कि आपको कुशल मेडिस चाहिए यू कैन टेक हिम फॉर केन विलियमसन बट अगेन कुशल इज अ मोर हाई रिस्क हाई रिकॉर्ड एज कम्पेयर टू केन विलियमसन तो यू कैन टेक अ कॉल दैट स्लाइट गड फील कॉल है केन विलियमसन पे चल जाए तो चल जाए नहीं तो यू कैन ऑल दिस्ट पार्टी मोट I think the internet also stopped because we were discussing KPIs. All right, I think we have lost uh, Nikhil Bai's internet there. But yes, he was uh, speaking about Kane Williamson and how he might be able to be that accumulator for your team, play a similar role to Nisanka, so can be handy and is not someone who will take high risk. So. especially when the other batsmen are not really shining or showing any great rewards in that scenario he becomes a good safe choice you are with us nikhil bhai yes i could hear everything i don't know what happened there ah okay okay so on to the all rounders <laughs> we have gone with uh, hasanga chamika and shanaka now chamika and shanaka why we have back more is because they have lost another pacer and now they are not even going into reserves like their reserve pacers are also injured they are going yeah. they have called players from sri lanka so we don't know how match ready they are so even yeah. if they play will they bowl full overs or will these guys bowl because they have played games understood the condition so we feel like that might happen plus they yeah. contribute with the bat so we have gone with them bilkul i think kafi obvious call hai wahan pe ek agar aap kahe ki ek player jo aapko lagega ki yaar yahan pe ek kyun nahi hai तो वो है मिड सेंटर क्योंकि अगर हम एक्सपेक्ट कर रहे हैं कि स्पिन को भी थोड़ी हेल्प हो तो विशो वॉट अक्सर पटेल डेथ इन द गेम दैट इंडिया प्लेयर अगेंस्ट नेदरलैंड्स एट द सेम विंडो तो हमने जस्ट विच जस्ट बैट पेस ओवर स्पिन एज ऑफ नाउ प्री मैच ऑन द डे पिच के अगर हमें सही रिपोर्ट मिल जाए और वैसे ही चले जैसे एक्सपेक्ट कर रहे हैं तो मे बी यू कूड इजली स्वेप आउट वन ऑफ द पेसर्स फॉर एन एक्स्ट्रा स्पिन ऑप्शन फ्रॉम न्यूजीलैंड and uh, i think ye teeno to i think sabhi ke team mein aapko milenge varindu chamika and sanaka i think sanaka could possibly play a bigger role as well a both hmm. with the bat and ball and think that if sri lanka are to win he has to play a prime role because the lack of bowling options that they have in base department it could really haunt them if he doesn't step up with chamika and of course uh, thikshana to aap lenge kyunki is pe nahi aur agar hold mil raha hai sydney mein to uh, he can exploit that actually he is probably someone who's done it better in second innings at times uh, hmm. we discussed this in the previous videos where uh, pressure me zyada better bowling karne ki uh, possibility hoti and the other three pacers are as obvious as they can be right and another key reason why we have not opted for uh, santner is we discussed short square boundaries and there's also rajapaksa and asalanka both who asalanka especially batted really well in the last game and on his day he can easily capitalize on that boundary yeah. and you might see like nikhil bhai mentioned there might be the opportunity to even bowl philips in that case because we see that teams hesitate to use left arm spin yeah. against guys who are hitting it in the arc as a as left arm batters bilkul you saw that happen in the game with south africa and bangladesh that bangladesh were ready to bowl even their reserve coaching staff if they wanted an off spin <laughs> kyunki aur kisi ko dalna nahi tha bowling to It just says sometimes teams don't help themselves. Uh, Shakib quality है. अगर आप Shakib वाले सम को bat नहीं करोगे तो yes he got it for 20 runs but that's that's because you held him back too much and both batters were set. अगर शुरू में अगर आप Shakib को डाल देते तो I don't think एक और में भी सम मार पाते वो तो eventually भी क्या तो उसी ने दिया तो I think that is something teams are still coming to grips with in terms of how to best use matchup and sometimes Bangladesh overdo it but I'll not fault Sri Lanka also to fall in that route but again we discuss the options that you have here and uh, hmm. yeah the two batters we have already to aapko grandling mein dikhi jayegi all right bilkul and before we get to the grand league picks for this game simple question for you to answer to take part in the jersey giveaway who do you think will be the highest pointer of the match name of the player followed by the number of points no other format accepted and no multiple or edited comments whoever is fastest and first wins this बिल्कुल एकदम शॉर्ट स्वीट डायरेक्ट है नो टेंशन 
राइट बिल्कुल सो नाउ लेट्स हियर इट फ्रॉम निखिल बाय हिज ग्रैंड लीग ऑप्शंस तो सो टेल अस पहले पहले जो मेरे सबसे आई थिंक काफी ऑब्वियस ग्रैंड लीग ऑप्शन है अगर न्यूजीलैंड सेकंड बोलिंग करती है तो वो है सोरी साहब उनका एक एनुअल स्पेल आता है जहां पे वो चार विकेट लेके जाते हैं इस बार हम देखे तो श्रीलंका का स्ट्रगल्स हमने देखा है वैसे रिस्क पे तो इफ यू फील दैट विल हैपन प्लीज बैक इट्स सॉरी दैट तो वो आपकी एक प्रॉपर जीएलपी हो गई एंड दूसरे आई थिंक इट्स इट्स अबाउट टाइम राजा बक्सा स्ट्रक्चर मैंने पिछले एक गेम में भी उनका नाम लिया था एंड कीप बैक इन गेम क्योंकि वो क्वालिटी आई थिंक द इशू इज वेयर ही इज बीइंग यूज्ड विद द बैट तो आप असल में वो प्रमोट कर रहे हो टीजीएस को यूज करना चाह रहे हो पर उसमें राजा बक्सा की एंट्री पॉइंट थोड़ी पीछे हो रही है एंड ही हैज टू कम इन एंड गेट आउट पर अगर उनके पास थोड़ा टाइम हो आई थिंक ही इज समबडी हु कुड हिट अ गुड 20 बॉल 50 आल्सो गिवन हिज पोटेंशियल तो लेट्स सी इफ दैट हैपेंस बट यस दीस आर माय टू पिक्स राइट माय टू पिक्स फॉर दिस गेम फ्रॉम श्रीलंका धनंजय डे सिल्वा आई एम एक्सपेक्टिंग हिम टू बी यूज्ड अगेंस्ट कॉनवे चैपमैन नीशम because sydney there might be some hold in the pitch so he can do well in that case and the second case in point for him would be that while he does not play bounce well he is a good player of pace so sydney while we we'll expect these pacers to come hard at him they might not get as much bounce from the pitch so yeah. he might be able to come good in that department too and from new zealand for me it would be locky ferguson because he is not someone who overly relies on bounce to get his wickets and he is someone who will bowl that sharp skiddy yorker or beat you by pace altogether and while he has a good bouncer too that's not his only ace weapon and i feel he can rattle sri lanka with pace especially in a chase under pressure bilkul bilkul i think kaafi acche fair calls hai charo to in mein se kam se kam do to chale hain mujhe right absolutely so we hope all of you also have a great game go take part in all the leaderboards and answer that jersey giveaway question right now and we hope the rain stays away and it's a crazy good game yes please take care have a good game and have a nice